Hi, this is Angie Monko, life coach for intuitive women leaders. So are you a woman leader and you find yourself having this people pleasing tendency? If so, I want you to consider how you're people pleasing. It makes a big difference. Now, sometimes it can be positive. So, but first let me explain. If we give or please in order to be loved back or fed love, acceptance or approval, then we're making it all about us. It really is. We're getting our emotional needs met in that way. If on the other hand, we are pleasing from a higher self or a sage, you could call it a sage perspective, um, it's much more effective and it has a positive impact on your team and the people around you, your clients, everybody, your family. From a sage per perspective, we choose to give unconditionally which feels really good. Like think Mother Teresa, you know? True sage pleasing is making it about the other person. That's the difference. It's a huge difference. So I just ask you to examine this and if you would like some help or support in figuring out how to navigate those tricky waters and terrain, because it is, you know, there's a there's a, a fine line between codependency and, like I said, that first type of conditional giving and then true sage giving. Or I used to call it people charming, you know, because uh, it feels good, but it's not codependent. Reach out to me at HarmonyHarbor.com. I'm here to support you like you've never been before.